Gemini. Gemini. We're going to have a rough one today because the kids are up. And I just had two rough videos, but this is your weekly Gemini. Okay. Um, Gemini, sun, moon, rising, whatever, whoever. Make it do what it do. You're all welcome here. Please like if you like it. Like if you like it. Subscribe if you like it. Okay? All them things. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Carefully. They be trying to get in a mess. So, let's get this going right here. But yeah, subscribe so y'all can help me grow. Let's grow together. What we got for the week in Gemini. Uh-oh. Uh, 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 here we go. Gemini. We got the five of cups here with the two what is that oh one of these bottle these kids these kids all in the video five of cups with the two of pentacles here and the six of cups this week we're dealing with some loss here loss of something that was pretty deep to us with the six of cups and that we've been sort of going back and forth about loss of maybe things involving relationships that you've had since childhood with the six of cups this two of pentacles is interesting energy here though so we're gonna have to see what that's about i'm not sure what that's about so let's see what that two of pentacles was going on Hmm, what's going on here? That two of pentacles. Yeah. It's a deep loss here. So it might be actual physical loss. Um, maybe that you, you, with the judgment card here, it was time. It was time. So I'm getting a reflection, reflection energy from that five of cups and then another six of cups. Something from childhood here. It could be physical passing of a person you've either known as a child or in your family, Gemini. Knight of Wands and the news came fast. Wow. Why are all the, what is with this week? The energy this week. Lord. Yeah. So like I said, that information came fast there with the Knight of Wands, and then you have the Hangman here. I think the Hangman here has something to do with this Two of Pentacles. That's my daughter, you're going to hear her, because I got kids and they have. I told you. I told you in the beginning of the video. Um where you were juggling the situation in a sense that it was up and down and you didn't really know. There was like a pause, a stagnant. Um, this is going to be real specific for people that lost somebody. Clearly the message here is about that. Um, if it's not the loss of an actual person, it's the loss of a really deep relationship, friendship that you have had since you were a child or since you were younger or you have children with okay because the five of cups is giving me death energy like that type of ending energy um and it's been in this place of stagnant weight here for a minute and for a lot of people things were up and down and up and down um and the news came fast, so th this is what I'm saying. I'm feeling blindsided energy, like you just, like, boom, were blindsided. Um, almost like, like, it was time, but you didn't expect it, just like, it just happened. Yeah, I'm getting that. Um, oy, oy, oy. Let's get some more cards here. Hold on, because I don't want her to break this glass that's over here. Sorry, I had some glass over there, and nah, we not doing that. We're not doing that. We're going to try to be responsible, okay? 
to help me be responsible. These nosy, these nosy girls, they be all in the mix. Yeah, so like I said, I felt you were blindsided, like sort of like this thing just boom happened. Um, or will happen this week. So be mindful of that. It will happen this week. Yeah. So I don't know if you're going to see this before it happens, after it happens. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. what else we got for my Gemini's here? I'm a Gemini moon. So, you know, deep down, it's really who I am. So I should be paying attention. But I lit. Okay, fine. I literally can only do it like in retrospect, not like, you know. All right. So we have the the strength card here, okay, with the seven of swords. It's giving your lying to yourself energy. You're lying to yourself about how much it affects you. This is so specific. It ain't gonna be for everybody, but. Then we have the Devil card here with the Knight of Swords again. That and in that information just comes in like bam, very fast. Um, you have no control over it with the Devil card here. You had no control. You you have to stop lying to yourself though about why, what, who, how did it happen. Um, it could also be that you were being lied to about the severity of the situation or there was deception there with the severity of the situation. And you're trying to be strong through that. It's almost, yeah, like more of that. Like you're trying to actually be stronger. Um, like you're trying to have a chin up type energy. Like eh, life happens, this happens. But it's, a, it's affecting you because it's a deep relationship um, with a person. Again, friend, family member, romantic relationship. And that is gone. However that is gone, that is gone. And it happens very swiftly, very fast. <sighs> Let's get some um, oracle cards. Ay, ay, ay. There's like this, I, I'm getting like this um, deer in the headlights uh, energy, deer in the headlights vibe. Like, you know, you see the deer on the road and they're just like, like that frozen, did we have the hangman here? Yeah, that frozen suspended energy of like, what do I do? What just happened? Let's get some Oracle cards for you here. That's rough. Y'all gonna make it through, though. Y'all are gonna make it through. Because I don't see anything here that it's like you can't wrap your mind around it, right? Y'all are real intelligent. It's just a... It's an emotional thing. It's sad. I'm getting, like, a very sad... Ooh, come on now. We got for Gemini. Very sad energy around it. Very sad. It's making me sad. We got, you don't want Gemini to have any oracle advice? Well, no. Okay. I respect the property of others. And I listen to opposing opinions. I think the oracle advice here has to do with this uh, strength and this seven of swords. I think you're supposed to 
try to have compassion for this other person and respect this other person in this time here. Uh, or even other people outside of the situation, whether that's children. It's a don't be petty. <laughs> it's a don't be petty. Because I, I keep getting like that other people, it's like a collective thing. So you're not the only person in the situation that's that has this loss here. Um, so you need to include these other people's emotions and feelings when you're communicating with them. Or when you're thinking about what it is you want. Yeah. Heavy, 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 heavy. Let's get an animal spirit card here because we got to see what's going on. I love this little pocket one. Carry it with me everywhere I go. Well, and and the truth is, you might not want to hear anybody else's opinions right now. You might be like, I don't like. You're just trying to deal with this thing on your own and be strong and be brave and um, try to understand it. But I guess the point is maybe it's important for you with these cards here to go ahead and listen to people that you might not have the same opinion as and not to take so much not be in a want type of energy all right what do we have what do we have oh, yeah, yeah. remember i told you of uh, Y'all were the deer in headlights. This is gazelle energy, so you're giving gazelle energy. It's literally like they're in the same family, right? They, I forget what the, what the name is for um, that animal species where they're, they're hooved animals that have the horns. Uh, they're also prey animals, so they get preyed upon. Um, they get stuck, they get that hangman energy, right? Okay, and then you also have the crow. This is a very wise, intelligent energy. So when you're talking about respecting people's property, when you're talking about listening to people with different opinions, that's where this crow comes in. So I think it wants you to move from a gazelle energy. Um, the gazelle is also very fast, so that thing that just came in in that manner it wants you to be more wise about how you deal with the situation because it's very deep Gemini come check me back next week you know the energy don't stay and I'm starting to see now that the whole energy of the universe is really weighing on people for different reasons and things are gonna happen around this time you know we're gonna get the change of the season soon going into this uh, mutable Sagittarius constellation as we're going into that right we have to adapt um, so we're gonna go from fall to winter and that ad adaptation stage is gonna ruffle a little feathers uh, but You'll get through it. Just be wise. Be wise and respectful. And just take a listen. Um, don't be so quick to talk, to think. Just get gather the information. And uh, you'll get through it. We'll get through it. All right? Um, if you want to go back and watch your monthly under Scorpius, go to my channel. You can do that. Um, and I'm going to check you back next week, Gemini. I'm going to check you back next week. Just be mindful. And, um, yeah. I love y'all, so deuces.